his reinstatement application has been denied. Field. Right. What, what do you know about this? Right. So this was actually submitted back on March 1st, David. It has been denied by the NFL. Now, we don't know the specifics as to why the NFL denied the reinstatement application. It can be a, for a variety of factors. Reinstatement could be contingent upon showing you have been entered in a treatment program, whatever it might be. Now, we know that Josh Gordon submitted himself to a tre treatment facility last fall. So uh, the glimmer of hope that may have existed to see him on the field as soon as week one of this season not currently still there. Herman, when you hear this news, obviously an incredibly talented player Very who just talented. has not been able to not available to keep it together. To be quite honest, it's not available. And you know that if he gets reinstated, you as an organization have to say, okay, he's still a part of our organization, but you can't depend on him right now because he's shown in the past that uh, things go awry and, and you're hoping he gets his life in order so he can play football and, and help your organization. But you know this as a coach. He comes to your football team, you go, every day I walk in the building, might not be here. Yep. That's what you're dealing with.